This video, the third in the Golden Ratio cropping series, is a short interlude message to possibly allay some of the potential outbursts from those in the know, a group I love, by the way. Rather than impose my ugly mug, I'll add a slideshow of some of my images while I allay. First of all, yes, these overlays are prepared with a 2 to 3 ratio, and the Golden Ratio is not actually a ratio since it contains an irrational number we call phi, which is correctly pronounced phi, but because the social police at the time did not want any P in their circle, we have pi and phi. And yes, the 2 to 3 ratio can be reduced to 1 to 1.5, which is not the 1 to 1.618 yada yada of the golden section. Hmm. Perhaps I should continue to use section instead of ratio. Well, nevertheless, since we are cropping to the size of our camera sensors, which is to a size we'll likely print, these overlays are fine approximations, and I contend they still stimulate innate aesthetic appreciation. Although innate, these tendencies are also enhanced by an individual's personal experiences. And finally, yes, it's true that most, maybe all, of the clinical tests to prove a human preference for specific shapes, I can only conclude that the golden ratio is always among the top three choices of those tested. Surely this should strengthen my position that cropping to these two to three versions can trigger our natural attraction. So we carry on in these videos. We will continue to fray the mathematical exactness in deference to the primary objective of keeping the viewer looking at your image. The overlays can be used in two ways. A. Resize the cropping dimensions to 1 to 1.618 or B. Accept the 1 to 1.5 that our image provides and our frames favor. That's probably why cameras only have the rule of thirds overlay, because of the sensor size. The rule of thirds is an easy version of the golden ratio. Just as the one is an acceptable substitute for the other, so is the use of the two to three overlays a substitute for the divine proportion. It's also suggested when cropping to consider elements and combinations of elements within your image when using the overlays. In other words, the 1 to 1.618 does not have to be reduced to 1 to 1.5 ratio. You can learn to be content knowing that there is a golden jackpot hidden within your image, and this too can attract your viewer's attention. Still, play with the 2 to 3 overlays in your compositions and see if they don't somehow improve the impact and energy dynamics of your photos.